musician Shoma Josie reveals a shocker. While Shoma Josie may be traveling the world as Mzansi's next big export her roots remain a huge part of who she is, and she wants to give back to her community in Lumpopo by one day building a water park in the area. Sho was born in a village called Shirley in Lampopo and often visits the area. Growing up, she tells Chisilip, there were not a lot of recreational activities. That is why her ultimate dream is to build a water park in the area once she's gathered her coins right. I want to build a water park in my village. I love them, and I know other people in the area would too. Dot Sho has worked hard to put the area on the map, and has never been shy to talk about her upbringing. She said that, while the whole world might be screaming her name, she just wanted to make her hometown proud. I've never felt pressure to be something, I am not, or to make music, that other people will like. I think I have got this far, because I make music that I like. I make music, that I would dance to, if I was at home. That's what means the world to me. The Huku hitmaker credits part of her success to the support she got from her family and community, when people in the industry thought she would flop. I was lucky, in that I came out very unapologetic about my look and sound. I had a lot of public support, but behind the scenes, that wasn't the case. People thought my music wouldn't sell. They said it had too many lyrics in it, and Com of the time, had very little lyrics. I was told, that nobody wanted to hear my music, nobody wanted to hear so many lyrics. But I just kept doing what I was, and now everyone makes music like us.